Nottingham Forest picked up their first Premier League win in 10 matches, while they recorded their first home league win over Liverpool since a 1-0 victory in March 1996 under Frank Clark. Everton have won six of their last 12 home Premier League games, after enjoying just two victories in 10 at Goodison in the league directly before that. Erling Haaland extended his Premier League tally to an incredible 17 goals in 11 games as he netted a brace in Manchester City's 3-1 win over Brighton on Saturday. Casemiro's stoppage time header snatches a point for United in a 1-1 draw with Chelsea. Look to have won it with an 87th-minute penalty after McTominay wrestled Broja to the floor, but Casemiro's header deep in stoppage time, which was given by goal line technology, stopped the Blues from taking all three points. Leicester scored four goals with their first four shots to secure their first away win of the season and move out of the relegation zone. Wolves started brightly, but a stunning goal from Tielemans gave Leicester an early lead. Villa celebrate a big home victory. Aaron Danks is the first coach in Aston Villa's history to win his first game in charge of the club by four or more goals. This was Arsenal's first Premier League draw since January, ending a run of 27 league games without one. Southampton have won just one of their last eight Premier League games against Arsenal, with that victory coming in this exact fixture last season. Leeds United sank to a 3-2 defeat at home to Fulham in the Premier League on Sunday, leaving them in the relegation zone and heaping more pressure on coach Jesse Marsh. Newcastle United move into the top four of the Premier League after beating Tottenham 2-1 on the road at Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. It is the first time they've been in the top four of the table with as many as 12 games played since April 2012.